Welcome back. Today we learn a very important concept of solving questions of six attribute three set Venn diagram that is also called as advanced three set Venn diagram. What exactly it is? Let's suppose we have three uh, we have three sets. Let's suppose first set is about nationality, nationality, and it is uh, Indian or American. If it is Indian or American, so this term is very important or American. So in one set, a person can be an Indian or it can be an American. It cannot have both the nationality. So and let's have another set in which the person is it's about gender. So it can either be male or female. Okay. Male or female. Again, or is important. A person cannot be the cannot be both. That is male or female. And third set would be about let's suppose living okay so a person is living either in a bungalow or flat now if these three sets are there nationality gender and living then what is the possible combination that each person can have there are possible eight combinations right because two from this Two from this and two from this. So altogether, we have eight possible combination. How do we solve such questions? Solving such questions by making tables would be really very complex because we have three different sets, three different parameters, and each parameters contains two attributes, either Indian or American. Another parameter would come consist of male or female bungalow or flat. So we try to solve such questions using three set Venn diagram. So I'll tell you how. So let's suppose this is a three set Venn diagram. Okay. Now three sets of for each circle. Now each circle can be named as any one of them. Let's suppose for the I'm naming this circle for nationality. I can name this as an Indian or American, either of them. So let's suppose I'm writing it as Indian. And this set another circle. Again, I can choose any of the genders, either male or female. So let's suppose I'm choosing this as male and this circle, I can choose either of bungalow or flat. I'm choosing flat. Okay. Now, what are the regions now? Let's name the region A, B, C, D, E, F, G and H. Now, what does A belong to? Then a person in this region would be of his nationality or his or her nationality would be Indian, it is outside the male circle, so it would be female and it is not living in the flat because it is outside the flat region or the flat circle. So A would belong to, A would belong to Indian, also female, also not living in the flat, so living in bungalow, right? Similarly B, okay. What would be B? B would be a person who is not an Indian. So a person who is not an Indian would be American. He would be male. And it is outside the flat circle. So living in bungalow. Okay. So similarly for any of the regions, you can easily find it out. So let's suppose I need to find for G. What does G belongs to? G belongs to person all it's a Indian male and flat Indian male and flat right now what about I H H is outside these three circles so it is American female and not living in flat so bungalow so altogether we had eight combination and we can see that we have we can represent all the eight combinations right so you can represent E. How would you represent E? Let's do that. Indian. Then uh, it is outside male. So it must be female and living in flat. So simple. Isn't it? So this is how we represent three set Venn diagram in which each set has two attributes and we have the condition of or. Many people do not know this concept. And if you get a question upon this 
concept it would look very complex and you may not be able to solve this by using tables or any other approach so always go with this approach hope you have understood it thank you